whoever ventures into the crypt out of idle curiosity will pay with his life. This belief has always existed in the mountain village of Dargavs. The village is located in North Ossetia, in the Dargav basin between the Karmadon and Fiagdon gorges, at an altitude of one and a half thousand meters above sea level. Up to one and a half hundred people live in Dargavs. What does the word Dargavs mean? Translated from Ossetian, it means long clearing. Near the village of Dargavs is the so-called city of the dead. The locals never come to the city of the dead after sunset, only in daylight and only to cut the grass around the crypts. And they do not even look inside, so as not to disturb the souls of the dead. Tourists are much more careless and brazen in this respect. The city of the dead, also known as Dargav's crypt, is a complex of above-ground and semi-underground crypts built between the 14th and 18th centuries. It is the largest complex of its kind in the North Caucasus. In general, in North Ossetia there are only about 150 above-ground crypts, scattered all over the Republic. But most of them are concentrated here in Dargavs, in the city of the dead. How did this unique monument of antiquity and ancient accession burial place come to be so well preserved to this day? The legend says that once a girl of unprecedented beauty came to the village of Dargavs. All the men of the village forgot their families and fought among themselves for the right to possess the beauty. The angry women demanded that the witch be expelled from the village, but the men decided to act on the principle of no one gets it that way and killed the beauty. After that, the village of Dargavs was hit by a punishment from above, a cruel plague epidemic. Even the earth would not accept the bodies of the dead, so the survivors had to make earth burials. The complex consists of 95 structures built of roughly worked large stones with lime mortar. The outer walls are usually plastered and quite thick, from half a meter thick. The burial ground was laid out chaotically and without planning. The buildings were erected next to the previously built tombs, as needed. The crypts were usually closed with a wooden door or suitable stone to prevent the penetration of moisture and animals. While the device of a bolt with an internal lock on the door remains a mystery to this day. It is only known that these square holes on the right side of the shaft were used to insert a hand to open or close the bolt. Originally the burials were open, without coffins. The body of the deceased was brought in through a shaft and placed on a wooden desk or on already abandoned bodies. Later, open burials were replaced by burials in board-shaped desks. In the 19th century, when a cholera epidemic raged in the Dargavs region, the sick voluntarily went into the crypts so as not to infect their relatives and spent their last days there. This stone shelf on the wall on the tomb was used to leave food on it for the relatives who visited the dying. It is said that during the epidemic an inscription in red in a session language appeared on one of the tombs. Look at us with love. We were like you, you will be like us. Unfortunately, the inscription has not been preserved until today. The workers who carried out restoration works in the 19th of the 20th century considered them 
vandalic scribbles and painted over them with lime. The concern of local residents stems from the attitude of some tourists towards the tombs. For example, there are known cases of theft of human bones from the crypts, as well as anaphorized photo shoots. There is a case when a tourist posted on Instagram a picture of a human skull she was holding. This summer, after another photo was published with human remains from the crypts, public activists and the museum management agreed to close the crypts with wooden shutters, so that, first, tourists would not see the remains inside, and second, they would not try to climb into the structures. It was also decided to strengthen security at the facility. The ancient accession burial ground of Dargavs is an unique monument of antiquity that has been preserved to this day. We should treat it with care and respect. Thank you.